In this video, we'll factor the equation x squared plus x minus 6 equals 0. And we'll use these steps here to guide our work. First, we'll set up a skeleton equation. It'll look like this. Once we have that, we're going to add the signs in to our parentheses here, into our skeleton equation. So we have a positive and a negative in this equation up here. If the last or both terms are negative, we're going to use this format. So this last term is negative. We're going to put a positive and a negative inside the parentheses. So let's put a positive here and a negative. Now we find the factors for the last term, this minus 6. So for 6, we could say 6 times 1, 3 times 2. Those are the factors for 6. So what we want is for these to multiply to give us a negative 6, but when we add them together, they should equal the middle term, this 1x here. So I could see if I had a minus 2. 3 times minus 2, that equals minus 6. 3 plus minus 2, that gives me a positive 1. So I'm going to put a 3 and a minus 2 here. And now I can check my work with the FOIL method. First term, x squared outside. x times minus 2 is minus 2x. Inside is 3x. And the last term, 3 times minus 2, 6. All that equals 0. And let's put these together here. Minus 2x plus 3x, that gives us a positive x. And this is the same as we have above. x squared plus x minus 6, x squared plus x minus 6. So we've done this correctly. Now we should find the solutions that will make this equation equal to 0. The values for x that make this equal to 0. Let's do that. We could say x plus 3, that equals 0. Subtract 3 from both sides, x equals minus 3. Over here, x minus 2 equals 0. Add 2 to both sides to get x equals 2. And if I put minus 3 in for x and I solve the equation, it's going to equal 0. If I put 2 in for x, it'll also equal 0 when I work the equation out. So these are the solutions for x squared plus x minus 6. This is Dr. B factoring the equation x squared plus x minus 6 equals 0. Thanks for watching.